A new Georgia law is now in effect, which means you don't need a permit to carry a handgun. It went into effect January 1st, but comes with some controversy. WSAB's Archa Sashadri talks to Georgia lawmakers about this issue. Georgia Governor Brian Kemp signed Senate Bill 319 last year, but guns would still be banned in places like airports and government buildings. Opponents of the concealed carry say adding guns in streets would increase crime and violence. It causes me great concern. You know, there are so many gun crimes. There are so many shootings on, on roads and highways throughout Georgia because road rage has gotten to a point where people will just brandish their weapon that they have with them in their car. They'll start shooting people. But supporters say this would allow Georgians to protect themselves without carrying a piece of paper for approval and that the government should not interfere on constitutional rights. I think having the accessibility to this important public safety tool is extremely important in Georgia, especially with the uptick in violent crime as we've seen in Atlanta and some of our other larger cities. What do you do when you're walking down the aisle at the supermarket and you see someone with a gun and you don't know, are they there just because they are shopping and they think something might go down at the Kroger or are they there because they are going to be the cause of something going down at the Kroger? And I imagine it's equally fraught for law enforcement. Uh, if the owners of a fast food restaurant, if the owners of a hardware store, if the owners of um, Target say we do not want firearms carried in our store, they have a right to do that. That's their private business. Supporters say this would instill fear in criminals because their victims could have a gun, but critics say the guns could enter the wrong hands. Archit Sashadri, WSAV News 3 on your side. To request a permit, you have to be 21 or older or 18 if you were in the military, a Georgia resident and U.S. citizen, and no drug or felony convictions.